Welcome back, everybody, to the fucking blacklit forest. I think there might be a rave going on inside of that cabin. <laughs> uh, so we get one option. We can draw a random card. We can get packs, or we can do this. We currently have a black goat, so we are going to fill up our pack. Ah, squirrel card. That would be immensely handy, actually, not gonna lie. So we're gonna grab a squirrel. And we're also, ooh, stop him for a turn. Yes. All right, let's do the battle. Do we peer through the front door? Because that'd be pretty cool. The eyes have fixed themselves on the small cabin. It's warm light, a beacon in the oppressive darkness of the night. Surely, surely this cabin marked the end of your tra travels, reveals. Oh. Can I just run away? I cannot just run away. I am hesitant to simply... Hi! Steps away from the strange cabin you were presented with an opportunity. No enough for my boons, just any traveler. If you're able to pass my trials, you will be awarded mightily. Trial of the Find. The three drawn cards must include the waterborne sigil. Nah, not not likely. Trial of skin, the same draw cards must include a pelt card. Nope. Trial of the swift. Fuck! Um Based on the last battle, I'm gonna guess the pelts. The trial skins begin. Nah, we weren't gonna get any of those. Not a single pelt card. Failure. We repeat that once more. Trial of rarity. Winged. Trial of the finger. If you have a ring, you will, automa you will pass automatically. Do I have a ring? Wait, what's that? One, one. I see a clock symbol there. I'm going to take a photo of that so that way I don't lose that because I have a feeling that we're going to go back to that clock. Let's do rarity. I think we got some pretty rare cards. A rarity begin. Stoke, beaver, beehive. Now single rare card. Failure. It's kind of judgy. Very judgy. Oh god, hi. You can get any boons. Won't even be a challenge. Hello? Oh, hey. Oh! What you look like. You took your time out there. I'm itching for another game. Are you ready to play? Yeah. I'm ready. Hope you're adequately prepared. Perhaps one more to be safe. You bitch! Oh, Jesus. That moon backlight. Oh, is he going to have different aspects of each character? Oh, that'd be shitty. Mole Man, Mantis God. Right. Place a squirrel. Beehive. Around the mantis god. Squirrel. And greater smoke. Jesus, how many mantis gods? Two? Alright, draw you. 
grab the squirrel. I'm gonna pause him with a backpack, squirrel B. Douse. Squirrel, squirrel, douse. Thank you. Chime. I know what that chime does. Oh, what? At least I still have my squirrels. I can't do anything. Hello. Stale fish, hard shoes. Yeah, sure. Is that amalgam? Oof. With a black goat. Right. We have some choices, we just have to be smart. Nice fish, easy choose. And I'm sure. Squirrel. Make new fish easy. Squirrel. And then. Mine now, go fish. Cool. All right, we got some bone cards, so we'll do a bee, an opossum, and an opossum. Grab some more bones. Couple mantis gods out of the way. Wolf cub. Two. Oh, that's not enough to kill. There we go. Pray for what you can, but no, the rest will stay and fight for me. Yep, what is this one? Anti space would be struck. Uh, pronghorn. Stoked. Two. Let's go. Another scroll down, I guess. Or actually, a bit of a uh, be better there. Put you there, squirrel. Yep, and you're about to turn all my guards into gold. Take a seven from him. Yep, just do some damage. Thank you. I do get the scroll back, which is nice. Gold nugget just turns into another gold nugget, bud. Stunted wolf. Back and finish him. There's a squirrel. Squirrel. You. I'll say I'll hard choose. Fine. Oh, 
the Ouroboros. Can't risk that. Fresh trues. There you go. Thank you for getting rid of that orb. Getting rid of that guy. Bullfrog. Squirrel. Just leave it. That's one out of three candles. People will endure the onslaught of rare creatures, but your challenge was forthcoming. Shadowy figures formed before you. In their eyes, claiming a recognition of kinship, but colored by guilt, they were betraying you. Hey, Kamensky and Louise. I remember that one fondly. Cool. Rid of that. Trapper. Hey, this one. Still don't know what that does, but I have to find out. Pray for what you can, but know this rest will save a fight with me. Hooray. Uh, more powerful, ooh, more powerful bloodhound. That sounds good, actually. Squirrel. I don't know what you do, bud. Or Boros. Hard to disagree with you. Squirrel. Put the wolf cub there because that's an easy game back. And then he turns into a wolf next turn. Oh, you. That's fine. The Ouroboros is just going to become more powerful in my hand. Mantis God. Okay, great. Actually, no, that should be more than enough to finish off this round. Oh, Ouroboros for a win. Don't turn... Thank you. This damned moon. It's dramatic, yes. But it provides no value to my board. I wonder. No! Now that is value. I have the stinky rat queen. This has one power. Oh, it attacks everything. Hold on. I need to study this. Title lock. At the beginning of the owner's turn, a card bearing the sigil will pull small creatures like scrolls into its orbit. Omni Strike attacks all squares. Mighty Leap. Gotcha. What I thought. Rat King. Stink it up. Make it so it does no damage. <laughs> now it's time for my Egyptian God card. Alright boys, you do it. You really destroyed the moon. I suppose that's all that's left is to finish me off. Go on. Can I stand up? Do anything else? There's gotta be something else I can do. Do I have any really cool cards that I want to play first? It's not just finish it. Defeat Leshy. Oh my, did I just, I think I just beat him. Oh. The fuck? Oh. Uh...
Okay. Hey, the guy's a YouTuber. Cool. Oh, not what I meant to do. Uh. Hey there, card gamers. I'm the Lucky Carter, and this is another pack opening video. Today, I am opening Catch Monsters packs and digging for that epic, shiny Transcend Dog! And here, I'll add some crazy VFX with lightning bolts or something. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I am about to open my first pack. Feeling good about this one. Feeling real good. Ooh, so accurate. Here. Okay, and our first rare is a Birchkin. Not exactly a viable competitive card, but hey, it's a pretty one. All right, next pack. Feeling even better about this one. I gotta say, these cards are feeling extra silky today. I mean, they're so smooth. Not sure what they're doing down there at the, uh, the card factory, but um, these are feeling good in my hands. Okay, let's see what we got here. Some jank cards, maybe a few additions to my draft cube, we'll see. And our rare for this pack is Another Birch Dog. Not exactly riveting so far, but we have many packs to go. Next pack, here we come. I'll just cut out this part. Fucking, I love the the notes that he's making to himself in the video. Maybe partially because I kind of do that, and like I'll you know. Like, if it's a part that I know that's going to be cussed, I'll just, like, go, like, cut here, blah, 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 blah. Uh, just because uh, then if I'm only, like, half paying attention during anything and such, then I have that whole, like, hey, do this. So, yeah, no, I, I respect that. That's attention to detail. Hey there, card gamers. I'm the Lucky Carter, and this is a vintage pack opening video. Today I'm opening a few super rare old packs I snagged at a garage sale. I've got four packs of Inscription. Ooh. You would not believe the deal I got on these. Now, not all of you will even remember this game. I'm barely old enough to have uh, seen these going around in my childhood. Uh, for whatever reason, they only did one set of these cards and then stopped printing them. Uh, there's not a huge market for them anymore, but at the rate I got them for, there's not really much to lose. That being said, a foil mantis god goes for a couple hundred bucks, so fingers crossed. Really cool art on these. Definitely stands the test of time. Especially when you don't show them. And our rare for this pack is Blue Mage. Cool looking card, but not going to be worth very much. All right. Let's see what we got going on in the second pack. Huh. Uh, this pack has been opened and resealed. Hope no one snuck the rare out of it. That would suck. Come on, people, honestly. Who opens and reseals a pack? Huh. There's a set of coordinates on this card. Looks like they were drawn on with a pen. 49 degrees north, 123 degrees west. Uh, I think I'd have to check, but I think that's pretty nearby. Okay. Box yourself. Good move. Alright you guys, I'm out here, living my best life, got my trusty headlamp and shovel, always come prepared kids, alright, whew, there we go, yeah, okay,
Getting close. I think. Assuming there is a thing to get close to. This very well may be a massive waste of... That's why you always bring an extra battery, boys and girls. Every time. You gotta come yeah. prepared. <sighs> Key? All right. This is it. And now, we dig. I give a 75% chance it's a rock. Only one way to find out. Been buried that deep, if that's the case. What the fuck? Is that? Oh my god, you guys, I can't believe it. There's actually something here. Are you seeing this? I'm, uh, I'm a little confused. Yeah. Especially since most computers these days, well, can't think of any modern day computers these days. I'll take a floppy disk. Floppy disk. Yeah, there you go. Okay, 11 bucks. Cheaper than a foil steam ball, really. Alright, fine. Wow, great video! Okay, time to figure out what's on this thing. Hold on. The same fucking audio as the intro. For this game. Interesting. You do not celebrate often, not seldom give gifts. If you challenge her, you are worthy. Please do not be polite. Dig in. Uh, is there something wrong? Your prize awaits. Very well. Come with me. I am confusion. Stand right there. Who gave you that? You absolute ingrate. Give it back. Who the fuck is that?
got a leshy card. But no, but seriously. Like... Okay, a bunch of corpses. Classic. But the fuck is that? Unless that's... Unless those were all the previous iterations of us. That's Leshy. And that's not Leshy's car. Hello? I don't know what to do from here. Do I start a new game? Start screen. Oh. Hold on, if I go to, just a moment, go to continue. New game. Maybe? I hope that doesn't just reset. In the beginning. Wait, what? Hold a fuck on. Huh? Whoa, fuck. Okay. That is until the day the scribes arrive. Oh, I can speed it up. Got it. Each had their own method of inscription to create cards. Grimoire used her quill to inscribe the epitaphs of the dead. Leshy used his wildlife camera to capture beasts. PO3 used a particle scanner to copy the CPUs of robots. Magnificus used his brush to paint the wizard's pupils. With the cards created, the scribes had solidified their power. Until one day a challenger arrived to replace one of the scribes. Choose a starting deck to mark your ambition. That looks like a leshy. That looks like the robot wizard. I, I like the thought of undead. Your ambition is to replace Gamora and become the scribe of the undead. Yeah, take the deck. The cards were added to your collection. Cool. This sounds like the perfect place to start up next time. So I apologize that this one seems like it was a bit longer than normal. Hope that you guys enjoyed. We defeated Leshy, which honestly I wasn't really expecting. We're on a whole different kind of adventure now. Anyways, thank you all so much for being here. I hope you all are enjoying this as much as I am. I'll see you peeps next time. Bye everybody.